Hello, my name is John Lee and I'm the president of Alpha Training and Consulting. And I have a true passion for preparing students for ASQ certification exams. But today we're going to answer the question, how do I become an ASQ CMQOE? That stands for Certified Manager of Quality Operational Excellence, an excellent certification. Well, step one to becoming a CMQ is get the desire and fulfill the prerequisites. What are the prerequisites? Were, well, candidates must have worked in a full-time paid role. Uh, candidates must have 10 years of on-the-job experience. 10 years, that's uh, one of the higher requirements for an ASQ exam. Okay, however, if you have a diploma from a technical or trade school, one year will be waived. So if a diploma from a uh, technical or trade school, you only need nine years of experience. If you have an associate's degree, you only need eight years of experience. If you have a bachelor's degree, you only need six years of experience. If you have a master's or doctorate's degree, you'll only need five years of experience. Now, this may change over time, so be sure and go to the ASQ website and get the latest information on that. But it's been pretty solid over the years, so I think you'll be good with that. Step two. Okay, now you've met the prerequisites. Prepare to take the exam. Visit my website at www.asqcmq.com where I go over a class that's designed specifically to help you pass this certification. As you can see, we uh, provide classes for most ASQ certifications. And we've been doing so for over 20 years. So we, and we've been getting better for 20 years. So we have an excellent class for you. Here are all the lectures we have for the CMQOE. Uh, we also use the Indiana Quality Council primer on that also. So anyway, it's an excellent class. Hopefully you'll let us uh, join you in your certification journey on that. Step three, sign up for the ASQ CMQ OE exam. I actually have a lecture how to sign up for an ASQ exam, so be sure and listen to that, and that should answer any of your questions on how to make that happen. <clears throat> Now, the CMQOE is offered on the January cycle. What do I mean by January cycle? ASQ offers the ASQ CMQOE exam every other month starting in January. So January, skip February, then March, then skip April, then May. Every other month throughout the whole year, they will offer this certification exam. And uh, you should sign up a month before. I would give it... I would sign up way before then, don't put it off to the last minute, because if you do, you may say ASQ says you can sign up, but you go to the testing site and they say, hey, all the seats are full, sorry, and uh, you can't take it. So you want to do that earlier than later. Again, check out the latest information by going to the ASQ site itself and make sure nothing has changed. <clears throat> now. Uh, where does this lie as far as ha the pass rates on this certification exam? For the CMQOE, it's at 70% pass rate. So 30% of the people fail it. And how much time will it take for you to prepare for this certification? My estimate is 101 hours, at least if you take uh, our class. It takes approximately 101 hours to prepare, uh, successfully prepare for this exam. That's 70%. If you take our class, it's more around 90-something percent. So we have a great class for you. Uh, step five, pass the ASQ exam and do what? Celebrate. That's what we want to see right there. I always get excited when I hear students pass their certification exam because I know it's going to enhance their career. And I looked up the salary. I looked up several places and took the average. And at the time of this recording, you're around $88,000 per year. Now, I have a lecture in greater detail on that if you want to listen to it. I go over how many years of education, how many years of experience, what industry you're working in. So if you listen to that, you'll even have a better idea of how much you can expect to make as a CMQ, Manager of Quality. All right. As you can see, I've passed most of the ASQ certification exams. Hopefully, you'll let me help you pass yours. You can contact me at my website through the Contact Us option. And if you'll do that, I'll get back with you as soon as possible. Thank you, and have a great day. Goodbye.